Mate, I'm just heading footy. Sure you don't want to come? Don't you think you should do something? <laughs> Fine. I'll transfer my money to Ruth. Make sure you do the same. Just got off the phone with Ruth. She said you haven't transferred the money. You need to do it, otherwise you're not going to be able to come on the holiday. She's already paid the deposit. Yeah, I will. Just do it now on your laptop. I'll do it later. Just do it now, man. She needs it. I said I'll do it later. Where's your bank card? This place is a tip, man. Just do it. Pay her. Some mistakes people make when trying to help people with depression. It doesn't really matter who you are, you can help them. Engage with them. Engage with how they're feeling. Ask them directly. You know, if they if they don't respond, if they push you away, that's fine. Be patient. Yeah? At least they're aware that you're aware. But I suppose being open and active is the best advice I can give. Yeah, if they don't respond immediately, then, then fine. But I suppose it's about, a, it's about taking responsibility. Yeah, if he was shot, you wouldn't let him bleed out, would you? No. Well, it's exactly the same thing. Just that one's, one's more obvious than the other. We don't have to go on holiday. I don't want to go on holiday. <laughs> I mean, I do, but not really. Probably be rubbish anyway. Too much booze and I wouldn't remember any of it. Listen, mate. How long have I known you? Four years. And I've never, ever seen you like this. 
I might not have been the most available friend to you lately. I don't know if you noticed. Maybe you didn't. But anyway, if you ever, any time, want to talk to me about how you're feeling, good or bad, that's fine. Whatever. It's up to you. But I'll always listen. I just thought you should know that.